Okay guys, I'm um, this really pet tip first and today we're actually going to one of the most haunted places in the Chicago area. We're going to this abandoned cemetery called Patchler's Grove. So it's like in the middle of the forest my aunt is coming to. It's like on the south side of Chicago, even though I live on the west side, it's gonna be kinda far. So we may find some ghosts. I'm a little scared. It's one of the haunt the most haunted places in Illinois, so I'm kind of scared. And it's even is you can even find ghosts on daytime, so it's very haunted. And I, I don't know what will happen. And my sister is gonna find Pokemon for some dumb reason in the cemetery. So yeah, we're going. Get into the place. We're it's like in the forest, but it's not like it's like you see it like across the road is. It's very haunted, I'm, I'm scared and I don't know if I'm gonna find any ghosts and there is a very loud street over here. So, let's see how this goes. Yeah. Um, was, it was very haunted here. I'm scared we're in the forest, you can see here. And it's like straight over there. So I'm very scared I'm not finding ghosts or anything. And this is my family. We're very close by and it's known around the Chicago area, so yeah, let's see how it goes. Felipe! Oh no! I guess we're here! Very haunted. Let's see how this goes, or I see another pathway over there. I'm already getting to shells. There's like something over there, like a little birdie, you know? Whoa, 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 whoa. It was first, it's 92 degrees outside. And now it just got in here and I already feel like a, a 40 degree chill. What is that over there on the tombstone? There's like something red. Oh, it's over there. Yeah. That grave is in the No, but I see something red. They got the clock on. It's a what? I'm very scared. These, these graves are so old. From, 19, from 1852 to 1929. Oh, that's, that's a long time. Well, why would people just abandon this place? It's crazy. There's nobody else here, but I really feel like a 40 degree shell. Look at, look at. Well, some people even. Oh, that's so. Wow. Let me take some Have pictures. Have you even put graffiti? So this is a very famous tomb. They said there is like a girl like sat down here. They, somebody like shooted a photo here and they saw like a girl sitting down. And the photo will come up and screen like now you'll see it. No. Okay, yeah. So that was the pictures. Kind of haunted. I'm scared and yeah, so so it's like well, yeah. there there's tombs that are unmarked. Yeah, and there's also tombs that are unmarked. So you don't know where you're stepping. Yeah, my sister right there. She's hunting for Pokemon. Seriously. No, I'm not. Oh. So let let's go back to the pond. They they say there's another hunting story over there. Oh, yes, a lot of people have drowned in that pond, right? Yeah. And one of the most popular ones is that there was this farmer. Bobby. There there was like this farmer with a cow. Uh-huh. And like, and then the cow saw yeah, something. Don't, don't go down there. And like, the cow freaked out and pulled him into the water and they drowned. So yeah. there might... Yeah. There might be some dead bodies in that water. Yeah. It, it's uh, two year old, two year old boy right there. That little tomb right there.
Yeah, you shouldn't walk there or else you could hurt yourself. Lázaro, espérate. So, um, I just went to that place and it's been a while I haven't vlogged. The last time I vlogged was like at 2 o'clock, so now it's 9. But by the time you're watching this, is probably, it is probably, um, what day are we? I'm losing my mind. 9.30. 9.30. No, no, what day? 14. So, July 14. Oh, yeah, by the time you're watching this, is July 15. So, um, after that day, after July 15, it'll be my brother's birthday, but he really doesn't like me to um, film him, no, no, so I won't be vlogging at that time, because it's his rules, he wants everything him. So, um, so, I think my sister did say ghost. So, um, when we were at the pond, she said she saw chickens. <laughs> She's uh, chickens, which I thought that was totally stupid. I mean, why would she see? Why would she see chickens? We're in the middle of like it's it's very city over there. It's like a very city place, and there's chicken. Like seriously, we're not in a farm until when we got back home. We found out that for some dumb reason. <laughs> For some dumb reason, people will kill chickens on that cemetery. And also, I I always used to think, why is that place haunted? I'm like, not, just because it's a cemetery doesn't mean it's haunted. So what I found out that the reason it's so haunted is because back then, it, it was a normal cemetery. Nothing was haunted. Everything was totally okay. Until these people that believe in the devil came and unburied the bodies and they would throw the bones on the grass so the spirits got very mad so that that's the reason it's very haunted it's very mad so I'm not trying to make you guys be believe in ghosts but if, if you don't believe I'm proud of you but if you don't believe in ghosts then I don't even know what the heck are you watching this video so and there's also another legend that in that same forest um, there's like this ghost house that appears and disappears. So, um, I really, I, I hadn't learned too much about it. So that, that forest has a lot of history, you know. So, yeah, it's a creepy place, really. Yeah. But when we got, they say that if you go there at night, you feel like the floor, like there's like, like it's going up and down. And some people say that the dead bodies are breathing or something under there. But that's very weird to me. I mean, like, like, and they, they say in that pond, a lot of people had died in that thing. And the, the reason people would die, even though it's like, like four feet deep. People died because, I mean, like, back then people wore a lot of clothes, like, not today I'm wearing one tank top and shorts, um, back then they'll have, like, suits and everything, and boy, the, and the boy, the, yeah, the girls w would wear, like, a bunch of dresses, so, like, they will, like, it will be too heavy for them and they will get drowned, so it was crazy back then, that's how a lot of people died in the, um, Chicago fire, because, I mean, they couldn't get out and then they Clothes started to catch on fire, especially for women, which I felt bad for them. And a lot of people died back then because of, of like, because like the toys back then, they had a lot of chemicals and they had no idea. But I'm going to tell you something very gross. Back then, um, babes, what um, babies like got milk from, like the plastic part, my freak out girls, but... 
it had a cow's vagina. Which that's freaky. I mean, like, why would even children suck on that? So that was, so a lot of kids died from back then. They didn't, they didn't even have idea. So when we got there, there were a lot of young children buried. So it, it was pretty creepy. Um, I kind of heard something when I was there, but I expected when I got there to to like find everything so out of the natural. But since it was like midday, everything was normal. But I say if you go there at night, it's very scary. Especially in winter time, the trees don't have leaves. It's very creepy, and then like it looks creepy by the um, by like the branches and all. So yeah, guys, this was my video, and I don't know if I catch any ghosts on cameras because cameras you can. Camera, um, people may not see ghosts, but you can catch them when you film them on camera. So, leave a comment if you think you saw a ghost. So, please like, comment, and please subscribe. It's, it's like, like, come on, please subscribe. I, it means the world to me. I'm not being greedy because I want money, I just want to make you guys happy, even though I went to an abandoned place. That's, that's a stupid reason to go there. So, please. Please like and please subscribe and you may